so streaming giant the zone is set to broadcast every minute of the world boxing super series second season this has come directly from the world boxing super series themselves so it's no second hand source or anything like that obviously this is good content for the zone to have right off the bat there's a term which is used in the gaming community you know people who play video games online and the term is system seller and what a system seller is is a game which is so highly regarded by the general public and the critics that the hype around it will actually help to sell a particular video game console on which this game is available so let's say it's a ps4 exclusive and it's got really high ratings by all the critics and all the fans are talking about it that's a system seller well i'm not sure that the world boxing super series is a platform seller for the zone because this is a new online streaming platform i'm not sure that this is going to be a platform seller simply for the fact that very few americans are going to know any of the fighters who are in the world boxing super series let's just be real either at 140 or at bantamweight very few of the fans are going to know who these guys are so it's just some random boxing <laughs> as far as the average american goes now even when it comes to the hardcore american boxing fans how many of the fighters in the world boxing super series currently for the second season how many of them are people that even hardcore american fight fans will want to watch i'll leave that as an open question for you guys to answer but in general it's a good thing that some network has picked up the world boxing super series in america because it was baffling that hbo and showtime hadn't picked it up not even espn particularly last season when they had the super middleweights and cruiserweights in it a lot of americans who were hardcore fans felt kind of slighted that no american broadcaster was showing either one of those uh, tournaments the super middleweights or the cruiserweights particularly the cruiserweights i think a lot of the hardcore american fans wanted to see that particular tournament so yeah it's good that american boxing fans now have an option to watch the world boxing super series and obviously the zone is going to be bringing a lot more content than just the wbss so yeah a good start by the zone but they need to sign some fighters in the united states who are actually relevant that's what they need to do and that's going to be easier said than done but we'll find out in due course what happens with the platform so let me know how you feel about this in the comment section below people it's happening, I'm out.